Hi, right, welcome to GC Motors. Today I'm going to talk you around our 2018 Porsche Cayenne Turbo that has just come into stock. It's got an absolutely brilliant spec, this car. I can't wait to show you around it. Uh, so we're going to go around the full exterior, through the interior. We're going to look, take close-ups at everything so you can see full condition. And uh, yeah, all the, all the specification and features as we go. So there will be some age-related wear and tear due to the age and mileage, as you'd expect. But we guarantee no scratches through the paintwork, no dents and no scuffs on the alloy wheels. So we'll start down here at the front. So jet black metallic paint on this KM. And as you can see, it's in really good condition. It's been very well looked after this car. Down here at the front, obviously, you got all your black elements. You can just see a little camera in there. It's got a 360 surround view camera, this car, which we'll get to take a good uh, close look at when we're on the interior. Also, there's headlights there. Porsche's Dynamic Lighting System Plus, or PDLS Plus. As you might know it with the uh, matrix beam headlights there around the side here we've got 21 inch cayenne turbo alloys and behind them you've got those white calipers and these are porsche the pscb or porsche surface coated brakes uh, so i think they're a tungsten uh, disc behind with the with the special coating on there just get that extra bit of braking uh, braking power they're really really great brakes and the tyres on there, that's part of our check-off process. The workshop guys go over the car, check over everything, and they just make sure, as part of that, that there's uh, plenty of tread left on the tyres. Around the back here, you can see quad exhaust. And a clear tail light here, with the Porsche, Porsche logo behind. We just take a look inside the boot. As you can see, with it being a Cayenne, plenty of boot space in here. Plenty of room. Obviously, in really nice condition as well in the boot. So it's not had loads of stuff kind of shoved in the back. It's obviously been very well looked after. So there we go, power tailgate as well. Press that button and that just shuts down nicely for us. We can see as well, rear privacy glass there. Go around the side and the rear windows. Got the dark tinted glass. Okay, so next up we'll jump inside and we'll start in the back seats. So there we go, black leather trim here, gloss finish carbon fibre, and also the Bose audio system. Obviously a fantastic option, a really good sound system. The yeah, Bose system, back of the seats there looking really good, no kind of kick or scuff marks, anything like that. We just swing around. You can see there those headrests have got the turbo emblem embossed in them. And the black leather on these back seats is looking really good. We'll take a look around on the passenger side now. So the seats here in the back are heated. So the heated GTS sports rear seats. Let's take a look at the carbon fiber there again on that side. A really sporty feel there, and there's Bose speakers again. So yeah, quad zone climate control. So you've got two zones up in the front, you've also got two zones back here as well. So uh, plenty of adjustability for all the passengers, you will also get their heated seats in the back. Really nice luxury feature there. So on to the passenger side in the front now. Carbon fibre trim again there, and just in front of that, you can see memory settings here. So full memory package in the front, both seats, uh, electrically adjustable, heated memory seats here. So you can see plenty of settings there on the side of the seat, so loads of adjustment, get it set up for you, and then any other passengers or drivers that are using the car can get their, their own memory settings uh, set up and configured. Just take a look across the dashboard here. Again, we get the two-piece seats with the turbo emblem embossed there. And just get a good close look at that black leather. Okay, so we'll go around to the driver's side now. Just take a, a swing across our forecourt and showroom there. We jump into the driver's side now. Cayenne turbo aluminium kick plates there, so you know exactly what you're getting into. More carbon fibre trim here, 
Again, memory settings there for the driver's seat. And all your uh, window and wing mirror switches there as well. Dash in. You can just see up there as well, you've got Sport Chrono Pack Plus. That clock in the centre of the dash there, really important Porsche option. And we'll take a look down the driver's seat now. Up above, massive panoramic roof here, so you see two big glass elements front to rear. So not only is that letting all that extra light into the cabin in the front and the back, you can also open it up, so slide that front element back, get the fresh air in there as well. It's just the light. Really, really good feature to have there. So next up, we will jump inside. So you can see on the dash there, we've got just under 20, uh, 27,000 miles on the clock. Keyless start, so key in the pocket. Uh, jump in, put on the brake, twist, the, um, twist that there. There we go, and the turbo fires into life. Look at the multifunction sports steering wheel here. You've got your drive modes on there. You've got all the infotainment controls, and you also got your aluminium shift paddles on the back. And there is the sport chrono dial. So, like I said earlier, it's really really good and important option to have on these Porsches. And of course this one has it with the with the full list of options that it has. If we just take a look onto the screen now. So big central screen here, really sharp display, really nice and clear, easy to navigate as well. So you can see we've all put on our climate control settings. We'll just take a look at the uh, satellite navigation now. So again nice and wide. You can see uh, really easy to navigate around on. So you can see here, DAB radio, of course. So here we've got the drive mode. We've also got our suspension settings here. So this car has air suspension with Porsche Active Suspension Management, or PASM. See so here, you can adjust that off here. So you know, you've got the set it nice and high for if you're doing any off-roading, or you can get it lowered down as well for easy access. So as we pop the car into reverse, here is the 360 surround view camera, as well as your conventional reversing camera. And you can switch through all the different views so you can see exactly what's going on around the car which makes it uh, yeah makes it nice and easy there so down here we've got the dual zone climate controls for the front so obviously two up here in the front and the other two in the rear so we've got our really glossy illuminated switches here heated seats for the front the driver and the passenger suspension settings there as well. So there we go, we'll jump outside the car now and we'll go and have one last look at the exterior. So here it is then, that's been our 2018 Porsche Cayenne Turbo. So I hope this has been useful, hopefully I've given you a really good idea of the condition of everything and also the big list of options that this car has. So we're live on our website now, you can look at the pictures and all the spec on there and also all the details on how to get in touch with us. Hope this has been useful, cheers.